Hello, my name's Tom Kyle. It's Wednesday the 27th of August 2014. Uh, I just want to make a quick video to make something very, very, very clear to anybody who ever has this ever said to them by someone who's in the police. And that includes whether you're in the police or just the person speaking to you is in the police. And whether they're speaking to you as a fellow officer during work or they're speaking to you as somebody who they've come across in the course of their work and they're giving you special treatment because you're a policeman or a policewoman. Right? Um, the thing they say is they say off the record. Now look, uh, a little while ago somebody told me something off the record and they said oh you know this cop has told me this thing is off the record but he's going to do this, he's going to do that, he's going to do the other, he's going to do the other, he's going to do the other, he's going to do the other. Uh, he's going to stay on the case to the end until he retires because he reckons he's going to get some big arrests out of it. Uh, two months later, he's not on the case anymore, but he didn't even have the courtesy to tell anyone. Right? So any time you have a policeman ever say off the record, um, I won't tell you about the person who he said it to, but um, the policeman in, in question was a, uh, was a victim of a very serious crime, uh, as was I, and a lot of other people. Um, but the policeman telling him off the record was Paul Kirk of the City of London Police. And he's just a complete liar. He's bent as a nine bob note, as most of the City of London Police fraud squad are. They routinely try and harass, and um, well, not harass directly, but they make malicious rumours up about people who sort of put them in a position where they have to do their job. They defame them. They uh, refuse to do their job quite regularly. They ignore phone calls and they hide in this office. And unlike a normal police um, police station where you've got a copper on the desk who you you know can at least give some shit to if they won't let you speak to who you want to or won't take some evidence in, and you know they'll have to go to extraordinary measures to get you out of there. You know if you've got the patience to wait around there, they don't even have an actual. They've got a civilian person on the desk, so that's the one behind Bishopsgate Police Station. I'll give you another little tip, tip of advice though, um, in relation to that, but I'll, I'll save that for another video. Alright, thanks a lot. My name's been Tom Carr. Feel free to contact me. That's Paul Kirk. Um, hopefully, we'll get him um, banged to rights before he retires. I don't think it'll probably happen. I don't know when he's going to retire. Maybe he's probably lying about that. He lies about absolutely everything else. Okay, thanks a lot. My name's Tom Carr. It's Wednesday, 27th August, 2014.